What's going on YouTube? Landon Huffin here back with another race shop vlog and I've got some news for you guys. We are taking a big step for Huffin Racing this weekend and doing a travel double header. So yes, Huffin Racing will be hitting two different racetracks this weekend, both Wake County Speedway and Florence Motor Speedway, Friday night at Wake, Saturday at Florence. It's going to be a lot of fun. I got the guys coming over here. We're finishing set up on Gilbert. I've got some new partners for this weekend to tell you guys about, and then I'll break it down in this video uh, and break down what is to come as far as race day vlogs for this entire weekend and the content that you guys will be getting. So thank you guys for clicking on today's video. Let's go and get into it. This is Gilbert. Last time you seen Gilbert, it was in Victory Lane, but it had the High Rock Mountains on it with the Bumgarner Propane sponsorship, and now it looks a lot different. We've got a black nose and tail. We just took the wrap off. Put a new door on it so when we travel we can look kind of nice we don't look like we're all mangled up and uh, it looks good i like it it looks super retro believe it or not this is the same nose that was on this baby uh all year so this will be the car we're racing at wake county and as always we've got our high rock vodka number 75 late model stock oldsmobile that we're going to be racing at florence motor speedway on saturday night so wake county has basically limited late model rules for their late model stock division. So that being said, we can run our 604 crate motor and not be at a disadvantage in late model stock at Wake. Whereas if we normally would run the crate motor in late model, we would be at a disadvantage versus the Enforcer, the Ford crate and what have you. So excited to take Gilbert to Wake for the first time. Obviously I've ran the Cars Tour race there uh, in the Nelson Motorsports car, but never have we taken our Huffman Racing equipment to Wake County. So I'm looking forward to it. It's gonna be a little road trip for the guys. <laughs> last road trip we took was Florence at the end of last season. And uh, that ended up with Flynn and RJ getting in a fight. First of all, I ask questions to make sure. Everybody can't be as smart as you, mother Everybody can't be as smart as you because you think you got them know everything. So shut the up. 18 times a day. You ain't see me goddamn mad. I will come back there and beat the out of your ass. I will come back there, there and beat uh -uh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Hey, What the fuck are we doing? Yeah. Down. yeah. We ain't going to do that damn shit. Don't tear up a van up. Me. Both of y'all need to come. bullshit, RJ. Both of y'all need to come. Damn, man. Nobody else in the damn. What that shit I give my kids to make them go to sleep? What that stuff? I've else? been cool about Some everything. No. I asked. And we crashed in the race, so. Can't be any worse than that. So uh, we'll just have to see. Like I said, we've got a new partner on board for our trip to Wake County. Thank you to Central Carolina Scale out of Sanford, North Carolina for uh, stepping up and supporting what we're doing uh, in this uh, travel double duty uh, effort that we're gonna try this weekend. So thank you, Central Carolina. And then uh, normal partners up here on the front with Cupboard Express and Longworth Bell Bonds, uh, which they've been a part of our program all season. Look at this, full house. Hello, gut. Oh, what's that? How we doing, Rich? I'm hungry. There's a hat in there for you. Is it? Yeah, thanks to uh, Central. Central Carolina. They're nice too, they're rich in 112s. Sweet. Hello, Seth. A neon lager from uh, Mr. Dylan Wilson. Anytime there's a Cars Tour car on a beer can, you know I'm gonna drink it. Hello, Blake. Hello. What did SRI bring me today? Gears, and uh, I can't bring you a new body until next week because you're going to Wake County, but I'll go ahead and get the list together. But They don't tear that much stuff up there. I like to race them. The tracks are lit by floodlights. Don't like the yellow wall, but... Uh, All right, your time's up. Yeah, game off. <laughs> Seth's working real hard. Look at him. I didn't come to work. <laughs> this is a 632. Look at that baby. A little tiny gear. Oh, how's it coming under here, Gut? We're getting there. Have we broken a stud? Not Ooh. yet. Okay, do, please do not break stud. I told everybody about our trip this weekend in today's vlog. What about it? That we're traveling. So it's gonna be a complete shit show? No, it's gonna be fun. Yeah, it might be fun. We're gonna chase two trophies. And we said it on the podcast, but what would be a success off the track? I'll make it home. No, no injuries. No, oh, yeah, no injuries. And no malfunctions. No malfunctions. There's something else. 
I don't remember what the other one was. I'm about to tell Gus to turn that down because I'm going to get DMCA'd. Yeah. He can't even hear it. He's over there. I know. It. Bye, Seth. You suck. I'll see you tomorrow. Almost finished uh, scaling out Gilbert and then we've got to work on getting everything ready to load for tomorrow. So the way we're going to do it, I talked about this on the podcast, but if you don't listen to the podcast, I'll go over it. Uh, we're taking both Deuce and Gilbert to Wake County Friday night and we'll race Gilbert on Friday there in their late mile division for 60 laps. It's not uh, broadcasted or anything like that, unfortunately, uh, but we'll race there for 60 laps and then we will go from there down 95 and stay at a hotel somewhere in Fayetteville and um, we'll have both cars there both trailers there we're hauling the other car in Rich's trailer and we will stay there and then get up in the morning and go to Florence from there which will be only like an hour hour and 15 minute drive where it's usually about a three hour drive from where we're at so taking both cars to both tracks but we're racing Gilbert at Wake and then Deuce at Florence so should be a lot of fun <laughs> hopefully the blue van can make it So with this car being five on five, we obviously can't run the whites. So Seth uh, got off easy on that one, but we do got the chromies and uh, we raced them a couple of weeks back, but we're gonna use them as practice at uh, Florence or use them for practice. And then we're gonna race on those blacks because the blacks look better on this car. I don't know, let me know what you guys think. Would y'all prefer chrome on Deuce or black? Let us know in the comments. I forgot to safety wire some of this drag link stuff because we changed some of our right front geo and I didn't safety wire it. So now I'm going to do that. That's what she looks like with the chromies. So Saturday's race is live on Flow Racing, just like if we were racing at Hickory or the Cars Tour or whatever, it will be live on Flow. <clears throat> so you guys can watch that. But Wake County, like I said, does not have a broadcast, unfortunately. Uh, I think the uh, Florence broadcast starts at like 7 o'clock. All right, that's going to wrap this video up. I know it was short, but I really wanted to uh, tell you guys about our road trip. This is a uh, monumental moment for Huffman Racing. <laughs> Hopefully nothing goes wrong and we have a good, good trip and uh, shot at two trophies. So thank you guys for watching this video. The next uh, video you guys will see will be the first leg of our road trip and most likely Wake County uh, race day vlog. I don't know how I'm necessarily gonna break it down, but I kind of thought it would be sort of funny to make like a three-part series and vlog all the stuff off the track too. So the hotel room, stuff like that. I don't know, you guys let me know uh, what you'd rather see if you just wanna see a traditional race day vlog or if you want me to treat it more like a three-part series on a road trip style vlog and the race days just be a part of each episode. But thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you haven't already hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys this weekend. I'm out.